Hey ladies, how you doing? Don't mind a little thing right here. I was getting dressed this morning. Well, you you know what's going on, but I, I spilled some little body oil. But nevertheless, I want to share with you some of my favorite or mostly used body care hygiene products. So let me get into it, no particular order. First up, this Olay. This here is Olay Rinse Off Body Conditioner. This is the lazy girl method. I ain't gonna lie to you, lazy girl all day. If I'm taking a shower at night, I got like one more squeeze. If I'm taking a shower at night and I don't feel like doing all that lotioning and rubbing down and I just want to just still be moisturized, I do my normal shower routine, do what I have to do, bar soap, body um, wash or whatever, gel, and then I'll go in and use this, put it over my body, and when I get out, I'm kind of like moisturized, y'all. Don't sleep on this. I'll leave this link down below. <laughs> Next up is a little duo. I have used plenty of these products from this line before and I want to try this one. This is from the Beloved line. This is the um, the Whip Body Scrub. It's a very, very light body scrub. It's not like it has some real serious exfoliants in here. And I got the Correspondent um, Body Cream. The scent I have is Warm Vanilla and Coconut. I probably won't buy this scent again for the scrub. Um, again, I do like the scrub, but it's a very light, it's more, um, it's moisturizing, it's very creamy, very hydrating. However, um, it can be a little stronger. I think, <laughs> I, I'll be looking for the smell. <laughs> um, but the body cream, I can definitely see myself purchasing this and I'm gonna show you what I mix this with. It's, it's very faint. This line to me is very, very faint. I have I've had other fragrances and very, very faint. But nevertheless, it's still good and it's super affordable. If you haven't used body scrubs before and you're trying to figure out what um, level of exfoliant that you might want to use, because it's all different levels. You know, you got the strong, strong ones, like them look like coffee beans. And then you got the little soft, faint ones like this, you know, and it's more like, cream you rub it on and you feel a little exfoliants in there while we're talking about body scrubs this right here is my jam i have i went and bought another one i didn't even tell y'all i went and bought another one <laughs> this is the tree hut tropic glow it's the firming sugar scrub y'all i'm gonna bring it in this right here this stuff smells so good and it feels so good on your body do you see the emphasis how i'm doing all of this that's how good it smells this is my second one i done dug in it already this here it, it's, it's just good some things I do purchase and I don't even share because I put like, they don't wanna know. But this was a repurchase. I had to go back. And I'm thinking about going back to buy two more just to have more sandbox. I really, 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 really like that. And it's so funny because my daughter, she likes Tree Hut and she likes the foliage and stuff. But she, the fragrances that she like, I don't like. So I like more, I don't mind fruity, but this one here, I don't know what that means. That um, TikTok. Oh, this smells so good. But I can't even get. We ain't gonna keep. I, we're not gonna draw this out. So, like I said, this is a repurchase. Get your hands on it. It smells good. Target have them by the boat load. It'd be nice and neat. Walmart have them too. But you might have to sit through. <laughs> we love us some Walmart. We we do. <laughs> Next up is this foaming wash. This is a feminine wash that um I purchased. I purchased this because I was trying to find a honey pot. Couldn't find it. It wasn't on the shelves and I had a little bit left in my home. So I picked this up and this is the L foam wash. No fragrance. Sulfates, parabens, but with vitamin E. So I picked this one up. I really like it. So try it out and let me also know if you use feminine wash because i know some people don't some people do they have their um thoughts and stuff behind it but um i can get into a whole conversation about feminine wash because um all the products that we use have things in it that we don't even know is in it so mm, 
Next up is the deodorant. I want it to go aluminum free. I really, really, really guys, you know, I love the whole clean um, product world. I really, really do. But sometimes we get such a chokehold with all the products that we like, you know, and we purchasing them and then trying them, you know, I want to say like something that, prime example, Tree Hut. They have so many different fragrances, so many different scents. You want to try them all. But I really, really, really do want to get into more of a clean, um, product world but i'm not gonna lie to you guys i am a product junkie i am i just am but <laughs> i tried this particular deodorant out this is dove and i do use a lot of the dove products and this one is aluminum free coconut and pink jasmine y'all when i tell you what i like about this is it goes on clear now if you still got some water on you and you're trying to dry off and you're trying to put some on it's gonna do the white thing. But if you're dry and you're good, it's gonna go on clear. You're gonna go back get on your clothes. It's gonna be really, really, really nice. I like it. It smells good. And you know how there's so many deodorants out here where if you do have, um, if there's no aluminum in it, excuse me, it won't hold you. This will hold you. In addition to, you know, there's other deodorants that say, um, don't leave any white residue. This one has it covered. So. I like it, zero aluminum, and it might be here stay. Next up, I wanna get into some body oil and body, well, I call this a gel, but it says body oil on here. These two right here, let me tell you something. These right here, I'm going we about to get into the chokehold area. This stuff has me in a chokehold. I, I be using this one, and I be using this one. I use this one more, you don't even need much, and you see how much I have left, I had this for a long time. Again, if I'm getting out the shower, I won't, I won't, um, this will be something during the day because this one um, is really thick. So you want this to kind of absorb. I don't want this on my sheets. But this one right here, this feels so good. And then also, let me get it. I will mix these two because this is the coconut warm vanilla and this is the cocoa butter. Y'all, I'll be smelling. Mm. And then your body be so soft and the glow that you get with this and this mm, 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 mm. now normally i will have like a actual body lotion like um like you know jaw when you pump or something like that but right now i'm just trying to use up what i have i do have a nivea one that's on standby once i finish this then i will go into using that next up I have to, I, I don't want to give you too much. I have a video coming up using this. <laughs> and I kind of went in with talking about it. <laughs> but I put so much in the damn tub. This here, this is the degree maximum recovery fatigue fighter muscle reset tart cherry Epsom salt electrolytes body wash and soak. <laughs> that was a mouthful. Y'all. This stuff smells so good. And the good thing about this is if you just want to smell like fruit, you just want to smell like, and it's not too fruity, not too sweet. This right here, they have eucalyptus. Did they have a jasmine and lavender type combo? Y'all, this is so nice. And they have a, something else that goes with this. I need to go pick it up and figure it out. But at one point I was a degree head. I used to wear degree um deodorant but i got away from it i don't know i got away from it but this here thanks man i like how i smell last but not least and this is probably a fan fave this is the dove deep moisture nourishes the driest skin this here i had to get the big baby i was getting the other one like you know the little the longer one i said mm -mm. I need a big one because let me tell you something. I just like this. This is that body wash that if you just unsure, you just go in there, I wanna get a body wash. You get this. You don't have to get the big one, but you get this. This would never see you on. I like it because one, it's very creamy, it's very moisturizing. It doesn't sit on your skin. You know, it gets in there, it doesn't supposed to do. And it just, 
and you can use this as your soap if you want to if you're not into, into bar soap you can definitely definitely use this and later on i'm going to get into well not now but later on in future videos i'm going to get into like bar soaps that i really really like because i do use bar soap i do enjoy bar soap and um yeah so i'm not the type of person that likes to double cleanse i'll go in with a bar soap and then i'll go in with a body wash something like this and after that i'm gonna put on a scrub because i want to you know Go that dead skin off, if you will. Get nice and smooth. I want to follow up with a good old polisher. That's what this is to me. This right here, you know what? Matter of fact, when I go out today, I gotta give one because I got like a couple more squeezes. It's super light too, super super light. But yeah, y'all, let me know what are some of your shower, bath, hygiene, body care products that you like to use on a daily basis. Or even, you know, when you're just doing like your little self care Because it's all products that we don't use every day. We save them for like, you know, special occasions or when we want to pamper ourselves. Because sometimes, you know, I do have like some, um, I have bath bombs and things like that where you use those when you want to pamper yourself and, you know, you want to sit down and soak or just those moments so i do have products like that but let me know what you like to use so don't forget props will be linked down below and also let me know what are your favorite products <laughs>